Hi there, and welcome to Particle Physics Brick by Brick, where we're trying to explain as much about particle physics as we can through the medium of Lego. In this short video, we are going to be talking about fermions. So a fermion is a particle with a quantum spin of half integer value, such as a half or three over two. And consequently, they obey Fermi Dirac statistics, which limits the way in which they interact with one another. The fundamental particles of quarks and leptons have a spin of a half, while composite particles that are made from quarks, like baryons, can have a spin of a half or have an excited state with a spin of three over two. Now, if we imagine fermions like dice, these are my two fermionic dice. Any two fermions are indistinguishable from one another. They can be interchanged without us noticing, but they are also not allowed to occupy the same state, which means that we cannot have them face up with the same number. These states aren't possible. Because fermions may not occupy the same state as one another, they tend to build on top of one another into higher energy stacks. This means that they form things such as baryons, nuclei, atoms, and other things with ever more complex structure, because all of them cannot exist in the same position with the same energy and the same spin direction. They were named after Italian physicist Enrico Fermi, who along with English physicist Paul Dirac, correctly first identified the statistical treatment of electrons. The word fermion was coined by Paul Dirac himself in a lecture that he gave in 1945. It is literally just Fermi's name with the on suffix at the end, which as you see has been used to essentially denote that this is a particle, but it is from the ancient Greek, it is a suffix which essentially turns a word into a noun. Thanks for listening. If you would like to know more, subscribe to my YouTube channel or follow me on social media for more information. You could also buy the book. Particle Physics Brick by Brick is available through online retailers and many local bookstores. Other languages are also available. If you follow this bit.ly link, you can also get access to lots of educational resources and information on where you can get your hands on LEGO to play along. LEGO is a registered trademark of the LEGO Group, which does not sponsor, authorise or endorse these videos in any way.